How's it going, everyone? We have a new bundle in Marvel Snap today, and that is the Deadpool Birth Pool Bundle. Is that what it's called? I should probably know this before I start the video. It is the Deadpool Day Birth Pool Bundle. This is the last bundle that's going to be offered in February for Marvel Snap, and it is the best value bundle that has been released in February. I think it's actually better than the ones we've seen previously, aside from the Sunspot Bundle. I believe. But before we get started, there is a lot of new bundles coming out in March. They're doing something a little bit different where they offer a lot more collector tokens for cheaper. They're doing like weekly collector token bundles. So the video I filmed last week giving a value of collector tokens, I may have to reevaluate the value of tokens depending on the new information that comes out for these March bundles and if they're going to release them in future months as well. I may have to evaluate bundles based on an average of what you can normally get in a bundle and recommend to you guys whether it's a good buy or a bad buy. So quick video today, but as usual, before we get started, if you love all things Marvel Snap and you love video games, make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, I'm trying to get to a thousand subs. I'm almost there, I think I'm about 50 away. So consider subscribing if you like the content, get to the bundle. So the Deadpool bundle, I really like this variant. I think it's really cool. I bought it immediately. The bundle costs 3,200 gold, which is about $40 US. And for that 3,200 gold, you're going to get 3,200 credits, 1,500 collector tokens, 291 Deadpool boosters, one title, one variant, and one avatar. It's very close to the $100 bundles that they've been releasing, like the Mr. Negative bundle, the Sunspot bundle, the Cyber Monday bundle. It's very close, except this is half the price, but structured the exact same way. This is actually a better value than the Mr. Negative bundle. I think I said that in that video, if you are limited on gold to wait for this one, it's going to be more bang for your buck. But what can you expect? Obviously, you get the 1500 collector tokens right off the bat and you get 3200 credits from the 3200 credits. You are going to get 64 collector levels, which translates to 5.33 caches, which for you pool three incomplete players is going to be 133.33 tokens on average spendable tokens that you can spend in the token shop. This isn't like in value of series four cards or anything like that. This is just on average, how many spendable tokens are you going to get? And for you pull three complete players, you can expect 608 collector tokens, which brings the total to 1633.33 tokens for pull three incomplete and 2,108 tokens for pull three complete. Now, when we translate all this to kind of total value of the bundle to make it comparable to other bundles, we translate these 1500 tokens multiplied by the 2.32 843 that we figured out in the last video. This is the rate that I'm using for this video. I may have to, again, recalculate it for the bundles coming in March. But when we do that, we get 3,492 credits in value of collector tokens. When you add the other 3,200 credits, you get 6,692 credits in value in the credits and collector tokens. I don't put any value in the title, the variant, the avatar, anything like that. That's just icing on the cake. And so that's 6,692 credits for $40. When we translate that to $100, that is 16,731 credits, which when you compare that to the Mr. Negative bundle or the Pro bundle that has recently come out, you're getting a lot more bang for your buck for this one. So if you're gonna buy any bundle, this is the one to do it. I think this is actually better than the ones coming up in March as well. Don't quote me on that. I will cover all those in the next video when I kind of skim through all those bundles and give you my first impressions of them. For those of you who are not subscribed, I do a bundle breakdown for each of the bundles as they come out. I may have to change that up again for March. There's a lot of bundles. There's like daily bundles, weekly bundles. I'll figure it out, but I will give you the information and give you my opinions on each of the bundles when they come out. So that's it. As usual, if you love all things Marvel Snap and you love video games, make sure you like and subscribe, hit the bell. See you in the next one.